Good morning. Welcome to the 2020-2020 school year. I'm Miss Presley, your school principal. Uh, I need you up and awake, and that's why I wore something bright and colorful this morning. Uh, this is going to be an unusual school year. This time of year, we're usually, the teachers and staff are excited to see you walk through the doors. Uh, you guys have new school clothes on, a new haircut. Uh, you're smiling and greeting your friends, and then you're on the way to homeroom to see who's in your classes. But this year, homeroom is your room at home, so it's totally different. I just wanted to greet you this morning to let you know that we're going to have a great year even if we're virtual. So today is the first day of school. Uh, we usually call this our Hawk Camp. We go over several things together, get excited about STEM, and then what the, what the year holds for us. Today, I wanted to personally welcome you as your principal and to make sure that you know how much we care about you. Now, of course, not just your academics, your test scores, we care about you. And so we know in this crazy time that we're living in right now, we're all in different places. So we want to make sure you're okay. So if there's anything bothering you with this year, anytime, of course, talk with your parents, your guardians, but, but please know that we're here as well. We have an excellent guidance department. We're going to introduce you to them as well. But because we know it's hard to learn if, you have, if you're worried about someone or something. But uh, so we want to be there for you in that area. But we're excited about this new school year and we're going to make it happen because you know Hawks rise to any challenge. So thank you for your support. Make sure you're up every day, eight o'clock and ready to go. Let's have a great first day. Good morning, I'm Cicely Brown, lead counselor here at Alice Drive Middle in the guidance department. We know that this is the unusual start to a school year. However, we are still excited to get this 2021 year started. We want you to know that we are here for you. So as we go through the school year, please don't hesitate to contact us for anything that you may need. Now, we'll introduce you to our guidance team here at ADM. Good morning, and welcome to the 2021 school year. My name is Pedro Washington, and I'm a school counselor and athletic coordinator here at Ellis Drive. Although you, this year will start off virtually, we are always here for you to help, so do not hesitate to contact us. Again, I'm super excited about the school year. Go Hawks! Hello, I'm Dr. Copeland, one of the career specialists here at Alice Drive Middle School. And I'm Ms. Barron, I'm the other career specialist here at Alice Drive Middle School. Our role is to provide career awareness and exploration services to our students. We will introduce you to the 16 career clusters and guide you through different jobs through that, through those career clusters. We have started a Google Classroom and this is our code. There will be many exciting activities for you to participate in and we're looking forward to having you participate and turn some things into us and we're looking forward to a great year. And make sure you complete your career assessment when we put it in the Google Classroom. Bye-bye. Okay, great. Now that you've met our guidance department, let's talk about how you could reach them. We know that every start of the school year is difficult, but this year is even more stressful due to the pandemic and the virtual school. So we want to give you lots of avenues to reaching out to us. All right, so how are we going to contact the guidance counselor or administrator if we need anything? So if you go to our website, adm.sumterschools.net, and you look under departments, you can see the guidance department right here. So if you were to click on to guidance, you'd be able to see a couple different ways to reach out to your guidance counselors. So you can actually if you're, on a, if you're on here and you just want to take your phone and hold it up to one of these QR codes, it will take you right to a form that you can fill out to contact one of them. Or if you click on here, it will take you directly to a form to talk to a guidance counselor. So you just need to fill out your name, why you want to meet, what today's date is, what time you're sending it, 
and just send a little summary explaining what your concern is and they'll get back to you as soon as possible. Another way is if you just scroll down a little bit here, you could actually see the email address for our guidance counselors and for our career specialists. And another great way to stay in contact with the career specialist is to join that Google Classroom that uh, they just told you about. So to do that, you would simply go to your Google Classroom page and you would click on the join button, hit join class, and use that code that they just provided for us. M-B-J-Y-E-I-5. Once you type that in and hit join, it will take you to their Google Classroom. You'll see that is full of information for you and they'll have some different assignments in there designed to really help you. If you want to contact an administrator, uh, you could also find our email addresses right on our website. Again, if you go to Departments and just select Administration, it will take you to our Administrators page. And you can see the email address and phone extension for Ms. Presley, Ms. Edwards, Mr. Fair, and Mr. Masitis. Just a quick note, my extension just changed like as of today. Uh, so if you had my old extension, just know that my extension just changed 139 because I just changed offices. So in closing, I just want to tell you once again, welcome, and we really look forward to working with you this year. We highly encourage you to reach out to us with any of your needs. So to help with communication, I'm going to show you all of our personal cell phone numbers, our home addresses, our social security numbers, and our credit card information. Or on second thought, how about I just show you our email addresses one last time? 